Okay, for all you do-it-yourselfers out there, I'm gonna do a quick detail on how to vacuum or draw down an air conditioning system in an automobile. Um, this is the main component you need. Uh, you can pick these up at Harbor Freight for under $100. And that's a two and a half CFM vacuum pump, uh, cubic foot per minute. That's what CFM stands for. Uh, this is the vacuum line. So this is the line that's drawing um, air out of the system. And if you follow this up, this is an R134 AC system. Uh, here's your AC gauge set here. Uh, I don't know if you can see this, but I've been running this for about a half an hour now. If you look over here, you can see that we are now have a vacuum on the system because it's below zero PSI. And this is on the high side, the red. And the low side also is below zero. Bad picture, uh, bad lighting. But anyway, what I'm trying to show here is that I've now, you know, after a half hour, have a uh, vacuum um, in the AC system. This is the high side, the red, and this go hooks to the low side. Um, again, this is the vacuum down to the pump over here. So um, the direction, oh, first off, make sure that your, the lines are all on or open for both your high and your low side. And with that vacuum, it is drawing this way. So from the high side, it's being sucked it up and down on your low side let me get this right it's getting sucked up over and down so you're putting a vacuum on your system now i just want to show the two ports the high side and low side okay here's the uh, high side port um, this is a quick connect uh, r134 uh, gizmo here um, so you turn it on right now it's on so you, you know that'll draw out i can't do it right now because i got one hand but you want to make sure this is on so that um, you can draw air from the system. So that's the high side here. And make sure all your connections are tight. A lot of times I loosen them up to uh, get at the atmosphere air out when I'm charging. So always make sure these are tight. And let's just follow the, this is the, uh, this is the low side. You follow that down and you can see the fitting. Again, the lighting's pretty bad. You can see the fitting here to the low side. So we were drawing the system down both on the high and the low side for about 30 minutes. Uh, what, what I'm going to do then is go, I'm going to uh, stop, turn it off, let it sit for about 15 minutes to ensure that I maintain a vacuum, which will tell me there's no leak in the system. Um, again, that this you know this bar should stay below 